hashtag will awesome isn't not amazing enough is great now you can click on it it's not clickable Ooh, oh wow my first hashtag that's great hey you welcome again back to my channel in this video we are going to be we are going to be making our own our own twitter hashtag just as twitter hashtag is in php so we are going to be creating an hashtag that is clickable okay without wasting much of our time let's get into it so the first thing to do is to declare variable text that is going to handle my text so i'm going to say hi love to code or hashtag all the time hashtag all the time sorry okay so my text has been written then i'm going to have a variable that has that says the hash that i'm looking for now this is the hash that i'm looking for in order to make a clickable link to my uh, to my text so at the moment if i say echo echo text this is what we're going to get sorry uh echo text let me open my browser so we get this let me zoom it so i'll be able to see so but if, if i say echo text we are going to see this at the moment it's not clickable so we are going to make this guy clickable here and any other hashtag that we have in our in our text in our content okay so let's move on to the next one so after doing that the next thing we have to do now is to split it so we are going to say variable split equals to explode sorry explode so explode from space that is split from space in text split it into an array in text so anywhere there is space split it into an array in text so let's check what we have done so far so i'm going to say echo variable dump so i'm going to dump this split to confirm what we have done okay so let's see awesome now as you can see we have successfully we have successfully split our content so the first one the zero the one two three i love to code now after a success after a successful splitting the next we have to do now is to be checking the content one after the other where we have ash so anywhere we have ash we are going to make it a clickable link that is what we want to do now so the next thing to do now is to say is to use a for loop for loop so we're going to be using a for loop and say for i equals to zero that is i is starting from the zero of the hurry so if i is less than count that is total number of the splits total number of the splits so if it's less than the total number of the splits then high plus plus continue each written continue the looping so inside this place i'm going to i'm going to print out the data that we have again so that we know what we are doing so i'm going to say um echo split high now let's check it again now as you can see they are together it's working perfectly so the next thing to do now is to take out this particular um this particular variable now integrated with our i and say if if sorry now inside our if statement we are going to say if substring that is we are going to sub the first we're going to take out the first um the first letter the first letter of the of the world that we split we're going to take out the first letter and check if it's matching with our hash so if it match then do so 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 that's what we want to do now so we're going to say if substring substring from where substring from um from from our split from our split uh, from a split variable integrated with our our high so we are iterating from our split so we are seeing substring from this split that is check from this string if from the zero sorry don't 
don't be annoyed my auto completion so we are going to start from the zero to one that is this zero to one simply means starting from the zero the first index of the content and checking the first one again which is the ash this is the in first in this is the first in there that the zero that is nothing nothing at all pick nothing except one so pick just one letter from the world so we are picking this very first one here this ash that is what we are picking so i say if substring that is if is if if there is if there's an hash if there's an hash in this string then compare it to if substring split zero comma one is identical to hash so if it's identical to hash if it's identical to hash they are going to equal substring we're going to equal split sorry we're going to equal split so let's check it out now as you can see it's working perfectly it's working perfectly so now here we have it so once it comes out the next thing to do is to say split equals to that is overriding it we're going to override this content the content inside the split sorry we're going to override the content inside the split then we say um split equals to then new a new string and we convert it to an href then so our href we input the link we would like to add so i'm going to add ash ash then we concatenate we concatenate inside this place we concatenate this data so ash split and over here we are going to concatenate again and dropping our variable again so now we have changed the content after changing the content then we after changing the content then inside the for loop again we are going to implode the data so we are going to say implode from implode from sp imp implode space into each of the uh, into each of the splits so into each of this place sorry implode is going to be outside it's going to be outside the loop not inside the loop so once we implode everything that is joining it back together then we are going to say echo we are going to echo the variable that we attach the implode into the here will be results so echo results because we have joined it back together and they can now be printed as you can see we got it work awesome now let's assume i have more content i love to code all time well not every not every day but i will so hashtag will hashtag will awesome isn't not amazing enough is great now you can click on it it's not clickable Ooh, oh wow my first hashtag that's great okay love you thank you for watching my video subscribe comment share with your friends and if you have any video that you want me to do for you comment it in the comment section and i promise you i'm going to make it available i will try my best to make sure it work okay thank you for subscribing thank you for watching my video see you around